Hello everyone, and welcome to the start of an episodic horror called Fears to Fathom. This time we're going to be playing episode 1, and it's Home Alone. This one is free to download, so I'll leave the links and the details down below in the description if you want to play this for yourselves, alright? So, yeah, you can see here. Fears to Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survived. Each episode is its own self-contained little thing, and in Home Alone, I'm going to be playing as a 14-year-old boy who is, surprisingly, home alone, because my parents are going to a work outing. Let's see if I can survive the night. Hope you enjoy it. Here we go. Okay. I didn't want to put this up on Reddit just for it to be called a piece of fiction. I don't even know where to start. Excuse my lack of good storytelling skills. I guess I'll just start. It was the middle of summer. My parents had left for that weekend due to a work trip, which meant I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. I would sleep and get up at just about any time of the day, though I did plan on fixing that. And we're in. Right. Oh my god. That was the alarm? Holy shit. Yeah, that would make you wake up. Uh, so yeah, I've just awoken from a nap. And I... Oh, what was it? It's F to get out of bed, apparently. Fantastic. Okay, right. Uh, so yeah. Maybe I should just stay in my room for the entire game. Maybe then I'll survive. <laughs> just make sure to lock the door, right? Okay, looks like the light switches don't work. Okay. What we got? Oh, hang on. We got something down here on the desk? Hmm. Oh, I did have homework that night, but I was too hungry. Huh. Yeah, I, I had to eat something first. Okay, let's, uh, what was it, F again? Um, no, it's space this time, weirdly. Fair enough. <laughs> we got some weird keys. Uh, alright. So... Is it safe? Oh, messages. Oh, alright. Oh, here we go. Okay, uh, so... Let's see. We can scroll through all this. That's nice. Um, yeah, so Dad and I are going to be back on Monday, honey. Didn't I tell you that yesterday? Right, so, let's see. Da, 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 da. Probably going to order some pizza. Yes. No need to order anything. Already made your lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. Okay, fair enough. And then there's uh, Mason Oliver as well. Um, we can play Mario Kart. I'll let you know. Can't promise, dude. May have plans with Nats. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Right. Uh, well, I take it he's not going to be coming round. Okay, but apparently there's a lasagna in the fridge, right? So let's see if we can find the fridge. Probably down there. Okay. So this would be the master bedroom, I take it. My parents' room. Okay. I, uh... Someone just wandering around outside on the driveway. Is that my driveway or next door? Huh. Uh, maybe that's not too suspicious, actually. Uh, right. Oh, it's very dark. I, I hope I find a flashlight or something. Okay, wait, what was that? Did I do that? Oh yeah, okay, so... Right. So I can sort of creep on the neighbours. <laughs> or I can take a peek as to who's outside. Interesting. Okay, well, so far so good, looks fairly clear. Right, so... Let's have a look, shall we? Right, so the lasagna. This? Ah, <laughs> the food was cold. Well, you just took it out of a fridge. So, oh, no. Ah, oh, well, I've ruined it now. No, it's okay. Food was cold. Right, we're going to stick it in the microwave. Or the oven, maybe. All right, there we go. Okay, well, that's going to take a little while, I suppose. Um, so, let's see. What we got back here? Is there a door over there? Okay, yep, there is. Um, yeah. yeah, someone was walking around my driveway. 
Huh. Wait, wait, <laughs> where did that come from? Teleporting lasagna, oh my god, right, let's, let's close the door and let's lock it. Right. Did he say something about TV? I don't know, the text in this game, it seems to uh, come and go very, very quickly. Front door there, right, again, let's keep that closed. Uh, there's another door there, I think. Yep, but can't seem to use that one, I guess that one's already locked. Right. Okay, well there's the TV. Can I? Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna stand here, point blank, in the middle of the room, just taking a look. Uh, can we take a seat or something? Oh, right. Yes, that's exactly what we're doing. Right. What's on exactly? What is this? Did I bring a knife and fork? Nope. <laughs> Just scooping it out with my hands, as a, a typical 14-year-old boy does. Just gotta make sure that what I'm hearing is coming from the TV on the outside, right. I... Ooh. Did you see that? I think I just saw some fucking feet. Right. I'm, I'm thinking I should probably get done with this. Right, I was feeling very sleepy after eating the food. Yes, okay. Um, although going to bed right now doesn't seem like a, a wise move. So, just drop that on the floor, right? Turn that off. I need to... I need to listen. Oh, Mason, what do you want, mate? Hang on. Um, okay, he's gonna call it off. Something came up, but you've got to come to Jessica's tomorrow, apparently. I didn't hear a door open or anything like that, but I I definitely did see someone walk up the stairs. Could have been that guy that I saw lurking in the drive? I don't particularly want to go back up there, but I guess I've got to, right? And so far so good. I'm, I'm quite uneasy about this. I'm sort of unsettled. Sorry, Miles. Got to see you tomorrow. Right, let's let's close that door. Let's just check out these rooms up here. Maybe I was just seeing things, right? Also, does this place not have a bathroom? <laughs> it's just a, a notable exception so far, right? Okay. Can I just go to bed? I always close my door before going to bed, right. Okay. Let's see. Okay, chill out, dude. All good. I'll probably just go back to bed after chem. Right, well, I've st yeah, I've still got my homework, haven't I? I think I'm okay. Right, yeah, can we, uh, can we get this done? I mean, I've got a full belly now, no excuse. Mm, right. 12.38 a.m. Okay, well I've survived this long, at least. I got done with the homework for the day in about a few hours. Okay, well done. Nice. Okay. Yeah, a little bit darker now. So, we're done? We're done. Maybe now it's bedtime. Yeah? Oh. What does Mum want? Uh, don't stay up too late, you kids. I shouldn't get to hear from Mrs. Paula this time. Hmm. You kids? Not kid? I didn't see, like, my little brother going upstairs or something, right? Hmm. Uh, where would his room be? Doesn't make sense. Right, uh, to bed. Let's go to bed. Yeah, okay, it works. This really does feel like a slow build to a home invasion, doesn't it? 1.16am, I got up to get some water. Okay. Is this actually based on a story that this guy found on Reddit, or is this like a true story? Makes it a little bit creepier if it actually is. Right, let's get up, shall we? Right. Oh, it's very dark now. I don't like the idea of this, I've got to be honest. I seriously 
Yeah, I can't use the light switches. I don't really know why. There's, there's certainly no flashlight around here that I can use. Shit. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I, I... I don't like this. No. No, I don't. Okay, well... I guess I've got to go down to the kitchen. I can just about see my way to the landing and down the stairs. Bloody hell. Oh, okay, hang on, hang on. Anyone outside? I mean, I kind of hope so, right? If they're outside, they're probably not in here with me. Okay. Alright, let's see if I can feel my way around this kitchen. Hopefully you can see stuff in the video. It's very dark. Okay, well, there's no bathroom. I've got to use the kitchen sink, surely. Well, unless there's... Is there something in the fridge? Oh, hang on, hang on. What's this? Oh, okay. Looks like it's empty, but uh, I guess it's not. Right. Close that up. And then back upstairs, yeah? Or should we just sort of, like, check out the rest of the house? It's so dark. Oh, wait, what? Didn't I turn the TV off? Okay, I can't seem to turn the TV off. I can't see a fucking thing. I am going back upstairs because it seems like it's the only place with lights. And I got my water, so I... yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right, come on. Hop to it. <laughs> yeah, I don't like this. Okay. Right. Uh, oh, click to hide? Wait. Miles? Who's that on the door? You there? Oh shit, okay, th yeah, there's someone at the front door. Uh, hide, yes, hide. Under the bed? Yeah, we're hiding under the bed, okay. Uh, I'm gonna stay here until morning. <laughs> or until Monday morning, when my parents get back. Phew, okay. Um... So, do I have like a Game Boy or something? <laughs> can I can I just do something while I'm under here? Hold on, hold on. Uh, let's get out of this. Let's get out of this. Right. Don't need that. Can I lock the door? No, I don't think so. Fuck. Everything's so dark in this game. Let's have a look at that photo again. Yeah. I, I think it's that guy that was on the driveway. Yeah. And it's the same guy that I think did walk upstairs. I don't think I was seeing that. I don't know where he went, though. Shall I go to the front door and lock it up or something? I'm just trying to figure out how I advance the plot. Okay. We- uh, Four text messages? Bloody hell, man. Right, let me- <laughs> Let me just go back here. Okay. Uh, what we got? Um, Paula sent me, said she, he's been creeping through the windows. We're calling the cops. You kids lock every door and hide in your room. Don't answer the door, no matter what he does. Okay, lock every door. Maybe I had the right idea. So Paula's the neighbor, and she's what, across the road? Oh. Oh, hang on, someone's, someone's crossing the road, I'm pretty sure. Damn, I wish this game was a little bit brighter. Oh shit, right. He's got an accomplice. I don't think that was him. Right. I'm I'm hiding. Yeah. I'm I'm done. I'm done. Uh-oh. <laughs> Nobody rings the doorbell at this time of night. This isn't good. Okay. No, I... Okay, apparently Mum says everything's gonna be alright. Well, let's hope so. Um... Yeah, I, I kinda wanna go downstairs and make sure the front door is locked. But at the same time, I don't wanna accidentally open the front door and let him in. So, yeah. I'm just gonna hang here. I think. 
Jesus Christ, man. Leave me alone. Hmm, okay, right. I, I guess hiding isn't really the option. I've got to do something, haven't I? Oh. Oh. Hang on, hang on. The police. Hey. Where's that coming from? Oh. Oh, what? Oh, that's it? Uh, okay. I guess the police scared him off. I, or, or not. Wait, maybe that's the police ringing the... Wait, that... The game just ends. Okay, well, I, I need some sort of context to wrap that up. That's a pretty unsatisfying ending. For the most part, all I was doing was hiding under the bed, and I guess it worked out. I survived, but... Ah... <sighs> I do wonder if there was more I could have done. You know, maybe I could have locked the doors. Maybe I could have fought him off in some way. But then again, I don't know. I don't know how the original story went. Maybe it was just a case of locking himself in the bedroom and just weighing it out. If that was a true story, that's pretty creepy. But, um, yeah, as a game, it was kind of meh, quite honestly. But nevertheless, I, I like the idea of an episodic horror game, so I'll maybe check out episode two when it's released. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. And we're in. Right. Oh my god. That was the alarm? Holy shit. Yeah, that would make you wake up. Okay. I... Uh... <laughs> the food was cold. Well, you just took it out of a fridge. Huh. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Where did that come from? Did I bring a knife and fork? Nope. <laughs> Just scooping it out with my hands. I... Ooh. 12.38am. Okay, well I've survived this long, at least. Uh, I'm gonna stay here until morning. <laughs> or until Monday morning, when my parents get back. Damn, I wish this game was a... a little bit brighter. Oh shit.